Hello there, today I'm going to be painting one of my gallery pieces. We need to put you on the tripod. Be careful, be careful, don't worry about it, it's gonna be easy. This canvas is 100 centimeters by 150 centimeters. The other one is 100 centimeters by 120 centimeters. So this one's gonna be a tiny bit bigger. Because of this angle, it looks like I'm a giant in a really small room. I can't unsee it. To start out, I am sketching out the cupcake. The painting is going to be a mixture of oil and acrylic. To start out, I'm gonna do acrylic bases. And so I'm going to do a base color of cream for the frosting, dark brown for the cake, blue for the cupcake holder. Then I'm going to get my oil paints ready. I'm going to put the paints on my palette, just a dash of each color because oil paints do stretch out quite far. Use two different sizes of brush, along with my little cup of linseed oil to help thin out the paints. And then I start on the frosting. And this is a very long process of blending back and forth and making sure I have the right shadows and putting them down in the right places. And we just go at it. And oil paints are very hard to work with, mainly because the color that you put down is going to be the color that's pretty much there. At the same time, it doesn't dry quick, and so you can blend the colors into each other over and over and over again for a long period of time. Next, I'm going to get started on the candle, do a solid color of pink, and then I filled it out with detail work, but I didn't record it, I'm sorry. It's a twisted candle with some shimmers on it. For the fish, I'm just doing solid colors of orange for the base, and then I'm going back over it with oil paint. This again was a long process. We're on day two now, I've changed my clothes. Um, <laughs> overall, I spent about six hours on each fish. I didn't film it entirely because it was gonna make the process take just that much longer. I'm giving the fish a dark outline of acrylic navy blue because this is going to be the background color of the piece and I want to make sure to blend the oil paints into it. Then I get started on the flame of the candle. The base is a darker pink that blends into a light yellow and then solid white on top. And then I get started on the background. For the top bit, I'm doing a very dark blackish navy blue. And then blending it into a lighter blue. And I'm continuing all the way around, making sure to get all the edges. Going over with a second coat, and then I'm putting little shimmers of yellow lights, and I'm adding a shadow fish character in the background just to kind of help fill the background. And then painting everything again just to make sure it has enough layers. Um, this is acrylic paint that I'm using at this point. Blend in another yellow spot. I'm going to extend his tail behind the candle, blend that in, add some shadows over the candle. Now I'm going over some final details on top of the cake, little flames on the candle, and adding some highlights. Um, yeah, so here are two of the gallery pieces and I'm so excited to do the rest. Once the oil paint has dried a bit more, I'm going to go back over and do some more details. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, if you'd like to see some sneak peeks of my gallery show, please follow me on Instagram or Twitter or Snapchat. I will be doing lots of posts coming up soon. In regards to the gallery show, it is going to be on August 16th in the evening. The venue for the event is the YouTube Space London, and the event is free. It is free to come to. <laughs> that being said, I don't have more details at the moment because I'm waiting on the space to make a registration for anyone that would like to come will have to register more details will be coming soon I will let you guys know as soon as I can about the registration um, I'm excited to see you guys there I'm really nervous I'm, I'm quite nervous uh, about how this is gonna go additionally I am going to be at somewhere in the city I will be doing the meet and greet with Tom uh, my husband who happens to run somewhere in the city he made it he invented it and he's the director of it at the event I'm also going to be on the lifestyle stage doing live paintings I also have a a new full line of merch that's gonna be properly done. It's my first like set of properly done merch and that will be at Summer in the City as well. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Surprise, surprise!